how to cook buckwheat and is this buckwheat is gluten free or not i will tell you this in the end of the video and now i will show you how to cook buckwheat before this please subscribe to my channel my name is jana i'm housewife and i'm telling you about healthy food i have two kids and a husband and everybody needs to be healthy and very thin so buckwheat is a great product you can eat it in the morning during lunch in the evening and this is very helpful for any mother i will cook a portion of buckwheat for a family of two kids and two parents for this we need one uh, pan i take not big not small one middle one uh, we need the buckwheat not a lot of buckwheat only one glass one glass and 15 minutes enough to cook a whole meal for the whole family so i'm doing this i'm taking one glass of buckwheat there are two kinds of buckwheat one brown buckwheat the one that i'm cooking now and green buckwheat please remember the difference between brown and green is uh, that brown is already fried fried on the factory when it's uh, before it is packed so i like more brown buckwheat but next video i will show you how to cook green buckwheat it's also very nice but very different so now subscribe to my channel about healthy food and next video you will see how to cook green buckwheat before this i'm showing you how to cook brown buckwheat I will tell you one small secret. I wash the buckwheat. I do this all the time. With brown buckwheat or green buckwheat, I always do wash it. So it's very easy. I will show you now how to do this and uh, please follow me. What I do? I take very uh, nice and comfortable thing, you see with the small holes, put this buckwheat here and just go and wash it in the water. I use ordinary water, just put like this, look what happens, you see small pieces of bucket is on the top, I just take it away, I do this, clean, take away all water and leave this bucket like this, just uh, small dust and everything take away, then I put it back in the pot. It's very easy, but of course you can not to wash it. If you don't want, don't like. But I do this because I want my food to be as healthy as it can be for my family, for my kids. For the one glass of buckwheat, you need two glasses of water. Easy to remember. One glass of buckwheat, two glasses of water. I take clean water, just put it in the same glass as it was uh, with buckwheat. Two glasses, I remind you, two glasses of water. Very easy to remember and very easy to cook. What I do, I put oven on the maximum and close the pot. I wait a few minutes until the water will boil. You can close the pot or keep it open as you wish. I usually close because it will boil faster. I just wait because I have very nice uh, equipment. It makes water boil very fast, like one or two minutes maximum. After it is boiled, I put salt, a little bit of salt. I put like small, small piece like this. Just you can even not to put salt as you wish. It's up to you. It's still not boiled. I'm waiting a little bit to wait. After it is boiled, I will put the salt inside and then close the pot, not completely close, a little bit. And after this, I wait 15 minutes. In 15 minutes, buckwheat will absorb all the water and it will be ready. Just wait a little bit until it boils. So, do we have a gluten in buckwheat? The most important for me uh, in the buckwheat, the secret that buckwheat doesn't have gluten at all. This is one of the most healthiest food, uh, most healthiest uh, cereal 
I'm a mother of two kids, two daughters, and for me important that they will have a healthy food. Uh, one of uh, latest open secrets is that gluten is uh, not very healthy food for kids especially, and for adults as well. So for me important uh, to have as much food without gluten as I can. Buckwheat is a gluten-free cereal. It's a kind of cereal and it's gluten-free. Remember that uh, you can eat it for breakfast, for lunch, lunch, for dinner, with different kind of uh, meat, uh, vegetables, you can even eat it with sugar and milk. I will show you in next my videos how it can be, but now our buckwheat is boiling. I'm putting a little bit of salt. I make like um, five out of nine the temperature of buckwheat. I don't close it completely, I close it a little bit and leave in some place for um, water to go away. And since now it is boiling, you can wait 15 minutes and after this I will show you what happens with our buckwheat and how to serve it. 15 minutes passed and we are checking our buckwheat. I open it and look, oh it's so nice, it's ready. All water is gone, it absorbed all the water, it's salted, I just mix it a little bit to check if everything is okay and generally this is how it should be. It's a little bit uh, wet but generally it's quite uh, easy to separate. So I serve the buckwheat uh, with a big spoon. I don't remember the name of the spoon actually, but it's easy to serve like this. Just leave this one here and take small plate and put it here. So how to eat the buckwheat? I prefer to eat it with two different types of oil. It can be olive oil or different kind of uh, oil as you wish. Just put like this, as much as you like, mix it and just try it a little bit. Mm. Very tasty. This, the second type of buckwheat, this is for one of my daughters, she likes it with what? olive oil. Yes, this one. And another one likes it with uh, butter. I put second plate, I put the same amount of buckwheat and I take the butter because second daughter likes it with butter. It's still, wait a little bit maybe. So you can serve the buckwheat with olive oil or with the butter. Also you can add here sausage on the side or meatballs what your baby likes and uh, serve it to kids or your husband or yourself. My buckwheat, the best is with the butter, the same as my second daughter likes and it's really tasty. Mm. Unbelievable. Subscribe to our channel. I make videos about healthy food, especially about buckwheat. And now you can ask in the comments any questions about buckwheat because I'm a professional buckwheat eater and buckwheat cooker. I know thousands of recipes with buckwheat. Under this video you can find a link to my website where you can see a lot of recipes how to cook buckwheat. Also where to buy buckwheat. So go now down this video and check our website.